Just start off with just a jog. Okay, so we're just gonna do a regular old warm up. We get, because this is a lot of um, hips and legs, we just wanna make sure that we get a lower body really, really warmed up. <clears throat> Especially the sides. Okay, so we're just jogging in place. <coughs> And then we're going to switch into a step back right here. Step back, arms up. Step back and just bring the arms up. Okay. Stay right here. And we're going to take these stretches to the side. All right. Give me just a couple more right here. Sit down nice and low for five. Four, three, two, arms out. And then we're just gonna go across and down. We're gonna stand up and squeeze right here. Good. Cross, stand up. Keep going. All right, now we're just gonna go side to side. So we're gonna sit down, just start shifting. Side to side. Give me about 10 more seconds right here. And then we're gonna go into some squats. All right. Okay, so now we're gonna come up and down. Stand up, reach down. Reaching straight down. Trying to get a little bit deeper into the hips. Okay. Awesome. All right, now we're gonna come to the back of the mat and we're gonna go into some plank walkouts right here. We're gonna do two regular plank walkouts and then we're gonna do one where we bring the leg forward, so one more regular. And then we're gonna go into one plank walkout. We're gonna hold, we're gonna bring the leg forward and we're gonna open up. We're gonna step back, bring the other foot forward and then just do one more each side, right here. Just trying to get those hips stretched out and ready to go. Bring it up. And then we're gonna go into some jumping jacks. Right here, you can keep these low impact. Or you can go all the way in for another 10 seconds. And then we're gonna get our bands. Three, two, one, and we take a break. All right, so we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna get our bands on. So you can like take your time here. Just get them on safe. Um, I will usually do two. I do two bands sometimes. You'll see me do that. You don't have to do that. That's just because um, I like the two bands on some of it then you'll see me rip them off. So it just depends what we're doing. So I'm gonna start off with, I have a medium and I have a heavy on, so like just one band. Okay. And then once we're ready, okay. And I'm putting them above my knee. Yep. Perfect. That looks good. Okay. If that's too much, then move that red band down a little bit. If you feel like it's too much, move it down just a bit, but I think you should be good. All right, so here we go. We're gonna start off with small side steps. I'm gonna actually move this right here. We're just gonna go step, step right here. Okay, so we're just gonna step side to side, pretty low impact right here. You're gonna feel right away on the outside of your legs. It's gonna start to burn almost immediately. Okay, so we're just getting warmed up and trying to get these legs moving. We're gonna hold the core in the whole time. Two, one, now we're gonna go into a traveling squat. So we're gonna step to the side and then to the other side. So we're just gonna squat. There you go, perfect. Okay, so you're in it, and you're coming down one side, and
and then the other. So now we're inviting the glutes to the party. All right, you see the stuff just kind of builds. Lots of outside of the hip. This is what I'm talking about. Lots of glutes, lots of hip. Keep going. You've got five, four, three, two, one. Okay, now we're gonna come down and we're gonna go into a standing press out. So we're gonna go out right here. Um, up here. Okay. All right, so you're gonna come down and you're gonna just go stand and press out right here. All right, so the knees are gonna go out. So my feet are slightly out to the side so that I can really get my knees to push out. So you're gonna feel all that tension on the outside. We're staying low, back is straight. We're putting all that work into the side of the booty. One. And then we take a break. All right, now we're gonna go squat down, star up. Squat down, star up. Okay, so here you go, you're leaving the ground. All right, so now if you were gonna do this low impact, you would just stand up and you would star it up. But you're following pretty good right now. So if you need to go bring it down lower impact, so that's what you would do. But right now you're crushing a air star. All right, so just reaching down and coming up. All right, so cardio's picking up. Four, three, two, we take a break. 10 seconds off and we're gonna go into some kickbacks. All right, so we're just gonna start kicking back right here. So you can use your hands and you can actually push back right here. All right, so we're pushing back. We've got these bands, they're resisting on the side, and then we're pushing back, glute lifting, woo! Heart rate is high, and we're just pushing back. If you feel a little short of breath, that's okay. You got a lot of extra resistance, that's why I said medium weights today. One, and then we take a break. All right, now we're gonna come down, and we're going to squat pulse right here. So you're gonna come down and just start to pulse right here, okay. All right, now, whoo, you're gonna feel right away. Feet are pointed forward, everything's burning, everything's wrapping around, your chest is high, your eyes are straight, and you're just staying down low. If you don't feel it, drop it down lower. But there's no way. Oh my gosh, these suckers are burners. That's why I call it band burn. Two, one, and then come out. All right, now we're gonna move to the floor. So we're gonna move our mat to the floor. I'm gonna move this down and we're gonna get weights ready. Okay, so we're gonna start off with our booty bridge with weights and the band on the floor. So you're gonna get your weights ready. You're gonna move your weights to your hips. You're gonna come up and you're gonna press out. Down, up, press out. Okay, that's the move. All right, ready? And here we go. So up, out, and press, and then down. All right, now when you come down, you're gonna try not to touch your butt to the ground. And we're gonna try to keep ourselves lifted up but we got this weight on our hips, plus the weight of the band, or the resistance of the band. Woo, pressing out, up, and press. Okay, keep going, keep breathing. We're coming up and out. You've got less than 10 seconds, stay right here. Keep going, four, three, Two, oh my goodness, okay. All right, we're gonna go no weight right here. So we're gonna go no weight. We're gonna put those weights to the side. We're gonna just keep those bands on and we're gonna switch it over to our right glute right here. All right, so we're coming up and we're going up. One leg lift. So right leg is up. We're pushing through the left, good job. Okay, so now we're isolating. Whew, all right, so you're staying right here. 
You're staying up in the air. Keep going. Now you're not gonna switch your leg. We're gonna go to a press out. But we're gonna come down first and come down. Give yourself a break for just a second, pound it out. Now come right back up, get ready. And we're gonna go out to the side. So now we're moving it out to the side. Same leg that was up in the air, pressing through the left leg, out, out. Okay, burning like a, like a fire. Here we go. <laughs> right out to the side. Keep on breathing. Woo, all right, we're pushing through. Try to keep the hips steady, using your hands on the side. Three, two, one. Come down low, and then we're gonna lift up the left leg. So here we go, left leg comes up, and we're gonna start to just push right through the left leg. Okay, woo, all right. So you're gonna keep breathing. Inhale and exhale. If you're shaking, it's okay. That's what happens during this workout. Lots of shaking, lots of burning. You're doing the best you can if you need to lighten the weight on the band. You take one of the bands off. This is why there's no weight during this part. Two, one, come down. Pound out that leg just for a second and then come right back up and then out to the side. So now you're going out, out. So the same thing you did on the right. Now we do it on the left, moving it out. And in, right here. Woo, good job, Jody. Oh my gosh. Keep breathing. Okay, try to keep the weight in the heel of the right leg. Okay, so we wanna put all that weight through the right glute. Not in the toe, but in the heel. And take a break, right there. Okay, now we're gonna tilt going to the side body. Okay, so we're gonna take a break right here. If you wanna take a sip, you have time for a real quick sip. And we're gonna go into a side move. Okay, so we're gonna go into a side clam right here, heels together, and then we're gonna press up right here. But you know what? I'm gonna rip off one of these, okay? So I'm taking off one band. I'm taking off the medium band for the side. Okay, but if you wanna try, go ahead. All right, and here we go. So we're gonna go up and down right here. So we're coming up and down, up and down. Okay, so now we are working the side body and we're working the hips still, going up and down. This is really, really powerful for the obliques. And then you've got the legs working too. We're on our side though, so now we're really more targeting the side of the body. Two, one, we take a break. And now we're gonna go over to the other side. Right over to the other side. Two, one, and here we go. Open and close. All right, now watch as I'm going up and down. There you go. Lifting and lowering as you come up and down. Woo. So you're gonna feel it in your hips and you're also gonna feel it in your obliques right here because you're coming up and down. All right, keep going. You can even put your hand down for a little extra support. Two, one, and then you take a break. Okay, now you're gonna stay right on the side and we're gonna lift and we're gonna lower right here. Okay, so here we go. Lifting and lowering, I know. It gets intense. Okay, so now I'm up on my knee. Now, if this gets to be too much and you cannot continue, if you're cramping up, you go down to your side. If you can stay lifted right here, stay lifted. All right, oh, okay. Keep going, four, three, two, one, and then we're gonna go to the other side. Okay, so we're gonna go on to our other side. We're going into the side plank on the other side, and we're gonna lift and lower right here. Whoop, I just had a bow. Keep going, keep moving, I'll readjust. That happens. Keep 
lifting and lowering. <laughs> it's like the worst rubber band shock in your life. That's why I always gotta wear pants on. Um, band day. Lowering and lifting right here. Just make sure that you're staying real nice and steady. Lifting your leg right up in the air and then coming down. Okay, all right. We're gonna take a break, no more side body. We're gonna go into our upper body now. So, we're gonna go push up with a band. So we're gonna hold right here. We're gonna come out to a push up. You can do these on your knees too. We're just gonna lower and lift. Make sure you're gonna have your band around your thighs. Two, one, and here we go. Oh, you know what? I'm sorry, take a break. Take a break, pull that off your thighs. You're gonna put that around your, um, around your wrist, actually. Okay. I was like, why do I feel like that's not right? Around your wrist, that's where I want it. Okay. And you can take the yellow one off of your legs. Okay. Yeah. All right, we're gonna just go into a push-up, but we're gonna make sure that the arms are spread apart so you've got good resistance on your arms when you're coming up and down. All right, ready? Here we go. Okay, so 30 seconds right here. We're gonna try to pull apart our hands. So we're getting really good tension on the outside of our arms right here, up and down. Right here, we're gonna really, really squeeze the core. Now, if you do too much in a full push-up, you're gonna drop down onto your knees and you're just gonna keep the tension on your arms while we're doing these push-ups. One, and then we take a break. Okay, now we're gonna go into a tricep move. All right, so we're gonna come up onto our knees. We're gonna take this band. We're gonna, I'm gonna use the medium band. And I'm gonna put it around my shoulder. I'm gonna stay light on this. Like a purse. You're gonna take your whole hand. I'm gonna show you straight through here. And we're gonna push it back. All right, so because you're on your knee, you're gonna hold that band, and then you're just gonna push it back right here. Triceps. All right, here we go. Okay. And you're just gonna push it back. There you go. Okay, so we're just pushing it back, and we're just gonna hold it. Keep going. You're doing great. You can come up to a standing on your knees if that's easier on you. I kind of just tend to like kneel here, but whatever, it really doesn't matter. It's really about that push back movement. Good. No, nope, you're doing great, Jody. Just keep pushing back. If you feel it in the back of your arm, then you're doing it just right. Four, three, two, and then you're gonna switch it right over. We're gonna go to the other side, put the purse strap on the other side, hands through, and then we're gonna go right into it. Start that timer over. Okay, good job. Okay, so all we wanna make sure is that we're able to keep that band on our shoulder and we go straight back. Boom, boom. So that we're really getting the back of that arm. Such a tough area to work, but so efficient with the bands. It's really helpful with the bands to use for that. Keep going. All right. You keep going. I'm just readjusting my, my camera here. Keep going. All right, you've got four, three, two, and now we're gonna come up into a standing position. So we're gonna go up and we're gonna do a we're gonna do a twist. So we're gonna put this band around our wrist right here. And we're gonna be going up and down right here. And we're just gonna twist. We're pulling out to the side. So this is abs right here. Up and down, pulling out to the side. Really keeping that tension in the core, tension in the arms, up, down. Good, keep going. You're gonna feel this in your arms, side of the arms, the biceps, and we're gonna take a break. Okay, now we're gonna go into a knee drive down. So we're gonna keep this band here and we're gonna just start to pull down 
right here. So we're coming up and down. Lots of tone in here. Okay, and now, if you're ready, you can add a little pop right here as we pull down. If you don't wanna add the pop, just pull down. Right here, keep going. Woo, all right, three, two, one, and then we take a break. Now we're gonna go into a lap pull down. So we're gonna keep it right here, and we're gonna pretend like we're in the gym, and we're pulling that weight bar down behind our head, behind and out. All right, jump in when you're ready. I turn around so you can see that my head is forward a little bit. So you don't wanna hit yourself in the head. So you're gonna keep going. Go right through that beep. Out and down, right here. All right, we're almost done with these bands. And then we're gonna move to cardio. Keep going. Woo! All right, you've got about 10 seconds. Keep going. Oh my gosh, the side of the arms are burning. Three, two, you're gonna take a break. Okay, we're gonna go water, water, water. And then we're gonna move those bands out of the way. I'm gonna reset my friend here. Okay, finish your water. Okay. And let's see, what did I do? You're just gonna take a break just for a minute here. Okay, so right now we're on a 20 second. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our weights I'm gonna actually move my mat away. We're gonna take our weight and we're gonna punch down right here. We're just gonna go side to side, punching down with the weight. All right, ready? And here we go. Okay, so no more bands right now. Now we got our weight. All right, our body is tired. We are already fatigued because we've got these bands that just came off. So if you start to fatigue really quick here, that's okay. Keep working with me. We're just going down. Good job, Jody's going all the way down. Woo! All right. I'm joining you, girl. I'm getting down lower. Okay. All right. Nice deep lunges. Love it. Working those legs. Working the arms, working the cardio. And then we take a break. Okay, now one wing. We're gonna go jack overhead. Two, one, and here we go. All right, jacks overhead, one wing. Up and down. Okay, up in the wing, up and down. Good. Woo! Uh oh, there is a pull behind me. The pull wins. Structure of the house, wins. Up and down, right here. You got 20 seconds, right here. If you need to bring it down, lower intensity. You just step the jacks. Step, here, yeah. Okay, keep going. Up and down, three, two, and then we take a break. Right here, okay. All right, now we're gonna hold. One way, and we're gonna come down, and then we're gonna side punch. Two, and here we go. Squat down, side punch. Squat down, side punch. All right, so you're going about 25 seconds each side. Now, if you can jump kick it, jump kick it. Right here. Okay, get ready. We're gonna switch it to the other side. Right here, down, other side. All right, I just switched that hand. Good job. Right over to the other side. All right, so we go half right, half to the left, down, four, three, two. We take a break. Okay, 10 seconds off. And now we're gonna go into a firework. No weights. So you're gonna come down and then up, down, and then up, right here. So 
So down, turn it up. Down and up. Okay, so now we're squatting. We're coming down and up. All right, you can use your hands for some momentum. Keep going down and then up. All right, get ready, we're gonna switch the side over to the other side. So we're gonna come down to the right and then up to the left. Down to the right now and to the left. Oh, you gotta switch your leg. All right, oh my gosh, okay. Down and up. Three, two, one. And then we take a break right there, okay. Now we're gonna go split lunges. So you're gonna hold your weights right here. We're gonna start with the left leg back. We're gonna go down and then we're gonna switch right here. Okay, so we've got weights in our hands. We're going side to side. We are rotating left and right. We're not isolating right now. We're just taking turns, dropping down nice and low, 90 degrees, straight drop down, and then come up. Okay, we're breathing through. These weights start to feel like 40 pounds instead of the 10-ish pounds that they are. Two, one, we take a break. All right, weights down. We're gonna move our mat out of the way. We're gonna go shuffle, shuffle, hop. So I'm gonna come down, shuffle, shuffle, and then hop. Okay, shuffle, shuffle, and then hop. Right here. Okay, so just cardio. Body weight cardio, right here. Side to side, staying down low. And we're going side to side. Now your quads, your quads might start to burn because you're staying low and you're going side to side, pointing the toes as you come up. Good. All right. Side and then up and then up. Okay. Keep going. Two, one. We take a break. All right. Water time. We're going to go back down to the floor and we're going to go into some core. This is an intense core. So we're going to go down to the floor. We're going to get our water and I'm going to show you your first move. It's a skull pressure into a V up. So this is what it looks like. Your legs are at tabletop. Your weights are up. Side, forward, skull crusher, up, and then you're gonna come up and hold. All right, so it's two moves. All right, get ready. And here we go together. All right, side, forward, skull crusher back, up, and then we're gonna come up and hold. Yep, and then back down. Side, forward, back, up, and then come up and hold right there. Okay, then then back. All right, so you've got chest going on, you've got abs going on, you've got triceps, you've got a lot of stuff going on here. So basically, your motion is side, up, back, up, and then you're moving up. Two, one, and then you take a break right there. And we're gonna go into just a regular crunch. Weights go down, bang, bang, weights. And you're gonna go into a regular crunch. Get ready, and here we go, okay. So you can do your crunch with your legs down or your legs up. So you can put your legs right here, or you can put your legs to tabletop, or you can put them extended. And you're just gonna breathe. Fingertips on the side of the head, eyes up, you're coming up right here. All right, we're breathing, we're coming up. Woo, two, one, and then we take a break. And now we're gonna go into reach ups. So we're gonna go forward right here. And we're gonna just reach right up. And we can just go right into that. Okay, so now we're reaching up. Upper abs are getting worked right here. Okay. Keep going, up and down, right here. Just making 
sure we're okay on time. Keep going. Okay. All right. Woo. Okay. Keep reaching. Three, two, one. We take a break. All right, now we're gonna go into a star crunch right here. So you're gonna come in and then you're gonna come out. And just go right into it right here. In and out, right here. Out and in. All right. We gotta watch your time, Jody, because we're almost at seven. So when you're ready, just jump off. Don't worry about the recording because um, I'll fix it for the class, but I think you can stay on it. It'll be done in five minutes, but if you cannot make the time, just jump right off. Two, one, and then we stop. We got nine seconds, and we're gonna go side to side right here, alternating. And here we go. So we're bicycle, side to side, right here. Okay, elbows out. Going side to side. Okay. All right. And we're gonna cut abs just a little bit short so we can get into a little bit of a cool down here for you. Okay, we're going side to side. Keep breathing. Three, two, and then we take a break right here. Okay, I'm gonna stop this and we're gonna switch over to a cool down now because I want you to get a little bit of a cool down. All right. So we're gonna go, okay. So here we are in a cool down. We're just gonna grab our knees and we're just gonna pull in right here. We're just gonna rock side to side. Put your knees to one side and your head goes in the opposite direction. Good hip stretch right here. We really work those hips at the beginning of the workout. And then move your knees over to the other side. We do a ton of leg work in this one. Good. All right, and now we're just gonna pull in. So we're gonna drag one leg back right here. Nice big stretch. And then to the other side. Okay, and then we're gonna come up into a runner stretch right here. Okay, runner stretch right here. We're gonna keep the knee back. Gotta stretch those hips after this workout. And then we're gonna switch it over to the other side. More than anything on band days, we gotta stretch legs and hips. All right, and then we're gonna switch over and multitask here. So we're gonna put one leg out to the side and we're just gonna reach over. And we're gonna stretch out the sides along with the hips so that we can finish up. A very modified stretch, but it'll be enough. I'm getting all the areas that we need to. We're gonna come up into a standing position right here. And we're just gonna reach down and hang right here for just a second. Side to side, shifting body side to side. And then we're gonna come up, take two deep breaths. Down, deep breath in. Come down, deep breath in. And come out of it and we are done. Woo, one minute to spare. <laughs> Hold on, let me stop this thing.